The complex and diverse landscape that surrounds Nushagak Bay in Alaska is featured in today's image captured by Sentinel-2. Welcome to Earth from Space. Nushikak Bay is a large estuary covering over 100 square kilometers in southwest Alaska in the United States. The bay runs primarily north to south from the mouth of the Nushikak River, visible on the top right, before exiting into Nushikak Bay, an inlet of Bristle Bay some 50 kilometers southwards. The bay is also fed by several additional rivers, including the Wood, Snake, Wary, and Ugushik Rivers. This true color image was captured by the Optical Sentinel-2 mission. The dark colors of the Nushagak River are most likely due to tannins, or lignins, which are chemical substances found in plants. Tannins and lignins from roots, leaves, seeds, bark, and soil can leach into the water and give it a brown or even black color. The sediments then flow southwards, where they are mixed with the bluer waters of the bay. The largest city in the area is Dillingham, home to around 2,000 people, and is surrounded by forests, shrublands, grasslands, and mosses. The rivers, as well as the lowlands around Nushigak Bay, are rich with deciduous trees. The dark purple areas along the bay are intertidal mud and sand flats. If we take a closer look at the image, a white rim around the southern parts of the bay is visible. Several thaw ponds can also be seen dotted around the image. Nushigak Bay is an important staging and stopover site for dozens of migratory shorebird and waterfowl species, and it contains one of the largest and most pristine sockeye salmon fisheries in the world. The Copernicus Sentinel-2 mission carries a multi-spectral imager with a swath of 290 kilometers. As well as providing detailed information about Earth's vegetation, Sentinel-2 is designed to play a key role in mapping differences in land cover to understand the landscape, map how it's used, and monitor changes over time. <laughs> 